training is going well. There'll come a day when we'll be ready to join you on missions. But you know, he, uh, he gets lonely easily. You should come visit him every once in a while. Says he's going to stay here and focus on running things as XO. No surprise with his body in that state. But apparently he has no intention of wearing a prosthetic arm or leg. So he doesn't forget the pain, he says. Boss, if you need supplies, let us know. Boss! My roles here include training our soldiers and supporting you during missions. Since I am still technically working for the GRU as well, I can't accompany you in the field. Don't take it personally. Please select a mission. Please select a mission. Please specify a project. Boss, do you think you could bring back more medicinal plants? Please specify a project. Please specify a project. Thanks for saving that cute little puppy. Please specify a project.
staff assigned. Staff assigned. Please select landing zone confirmed. Roger. This is Pequot. Arriving shortly at LZ. Hospitalized in Dekelia, a British sovereign base area on Cyprus. It's part of British overseas territory that falls outside of Cypriot jurisdiction. You got moved from Cuba's little America right into Cyprus's little Britain. Why Dekelia? The UK and the US remain close allies. The last place Cypher would think to look for you is inside their own system. That's what kept you safe in British military hospital for nine years. The safest place from a whale is inside its own belly. You were a regular Geppetto. Well, it wasn't Pinocchio who led me out to safety. So who was that guy? Cypher went so far as to attack British territory, burning their own ally. That's how badly they wanted you dead. Snake, try this on. A prosthetic arm. Yeah, Miller was calling it the arm that wasn't there. The physiotherapy's going well. Your arm's bulked up enough for it to fit. There. Perfect. A little time with it, and it'll work better than the real thing. What do you think? Huh. I can still feel my real arm. Well, you better get used to this one quick. You have any pain? Every now and then. Where? My fingertips. My left fingertips. Uh, sounds like phantom pain. Your brain still remembers your old hand. Yeah. What about your vision? Can you see okay? Yeah, at the moment. Now the shrapnel in your skull is pressing on your optic nerve. I'm told any hard impact could have an effect on your visual cortex. Yeah, the doctor mentioned that. Your brain might process visual information incorrectly. In other words, you could have hallucinations. You might see things that aren't there, or not see things as they really are. You experience any of that? I think so. When? Right after I wake up. Colors look faded. Colors, huh? Well, that's not a major concern in and of itself. 
but it could mean the difference between life and death in the field. You'll need to watch out for that. I will. All right. You should continue your physio. We'll be arriving soon. It's the last chance you'll get. to Afghanistan. Military's new weapon codenamed Honeybee. The CIA put it in the hands of the Hamid group of Mujahideen. But the Hamid fighters were wiped out. The Honeybee must still be hidden at their base, the fort at Dasmasi Laman. Unfortunately, the Soviets are looking for the weapon as well. You have to get to it before they do, and bring it back here. There's a photo of the target on your eye droid. One more thing. Apparently, one of the Hamid fighters survived. He's missing. But if you can find him, he might lead us to the target. Good luck, boss. placed.
Marker placed. Marker removed. Yeah. Prisoner the Hamid survivor? If he is, he has to know something about the honeybee. Well, you gonna help him? You could wait and see what the Soviets do with him.
Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. 